Shalom, and welcome to the Shalem Video Podcast, episode three. You know what that means, right? You guessed it. It's a chazaka. In this week's video podcast, we'll be joined by special guest co-host Daniel Cowan. Since I was recruiting in America for two weeks, Daniel was nice enough to borrow my camera so that you, the Hamish of you at home, can stay on top of the new and exciting happenings in our Ad Shalem, Aramaic for Shalemland. For those of you who might not know, Shalemland is just as fun as Candyland, but there's more learning, volunteering, and we play in Bat Yam. In this week's video podcast, Daniel will take you on a tour of Bat Yam, visit the Dati Hamer a religious public high school where he volunteers, We'll briefly experience Yom Hadassah with a visit to Kisaria and a capoeira demonstration at a Hadassah-owned Youth Aliyah village. We'll have an evening of learning at Chappelle's, and we'll finish up with fun at the Kefayada Color War. I hope you enjoy the show. Now to you, Daniel. Who is that well-dressed man in the mirror? Why, it's me, Daniel Cowan, and I will be hosting Shalane Podcast number Three! Of all of your spring Israeli drinks, what is your favorite, Shira? Passion foods. Shira? Passion foods. God is everywhere. But again, like, if God's everywhere, how can he be in that one room with us? Because he's a dialectic being. Like we are. Like, like no, 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 no. we are. We are like him. He's not like us. Rabbi Jason, in his normal dialectic, as a lonely man of faith, a halachic man, expressing the duality very symbolically through a conversation on his cell phone. Where are you looking for in Israel? Like, how do you find that out? There's so many places to go on this lovely map. map. There's and the Israel guide. There's the Masa book. What would you do? What would your fantasy vacation be? I'd, I'd stay in Bat Yam. We're going to now turn the camera back on to Bat Yam. <laughs> you know, it's a little more entertaining. Uh, we're just walking down the street here. This is um, Raziel. Let's pause this camera while we cross the street. Oncoming traffic, take one. Oncoming, oh, gotta get out of the street. Okay, woo! <laughs> Hello there, oh, Mr. Policeman. That's the policeman. He makes sure you cross the street when you're supposed to. We've just spotted God. <laughs> God, stop it. <laughs> God on the corner of Rothfield and Holy Cohen. What does what God drive? What does he drive? What is God driving? It's a Puga. There he goes. Oh, God needs to get his transmission fixed. Oh, and there God, it's a godly moment. That right there is our corner Makolet or Bodega if you don't parlay the um, Hebrew A. <laughs> um, that's Bodega or a, a mini mart. It's amazing how much fruit you can get for 10 bucks here. Fruit. Okay, those um, not completely familiar with uh, Israel might not also be com completely familiar with the number of chatulim, or as they say in English, cats. They're everywhere. They're devious. Oh, crikey, mate. They even got them cats under the cars there. Oh, he, he heard us. He heard us. We're going to have to circle around to find the cat. They're everywhere here. Oh, look at it. He's on the run, mate. He's on the run. Okay, let's find the cat. Let's find the cat. There we go. Hi, crikey. Hi there, hi there, oh, there he goes again, there he goes. And now you have a closer look. That says Kanyan Bat Yam, or Kanyan meaning the mall of Bat Yam. That's the entrance. It's highly securityized, which is not a word. Well, that's because we're in a library. This is the moment where all the viewers go, wow, a twist. Today I'm going to bring you for an inside look at Shalane volunteering as we head to public school Dati Hammer to watch some of our very own Shalamers teach and as we know, learn. Thanks, Daniel. I'm sure we'll see you again soon. In the meantime, let's check out Yom Hadassah. Welcome to the ancient ruins of Kisari.
This is the amphitheater. At the Ufaliyah building, watching Capoeira. Let's take a look. I can do that. In the evening after Yom Hadassah, a few of the Shalom guys went to learn at Chappelle's. It says Torah. Um, you know, like, we, like, we also learned in the last Rambam here, um, you know, like Ruach HaKodesh, like that, like he knew, from just like, you know, he just knew what God meant by it, like what, what God, like just knew like what to do and everything, through Ruach HaKodesh, you know, he had a connection with God and all, but so he basically, like, in, the, in a way, like he just kind of like, you know, when he would do something, he'd be like, okay, this is how you do it, because I can, I see God's reasoning, which like none of us can, today can see. Like, Back to you, Daniel. And um, yes, we're just enjoying that ourselves here uh, on Fun Day, otherwise known as Kaviyata Day. Like Have a look. As we told you before, you can sit down for the next two minutes. Let's see the cheer! I hope that you had as much fun as I did. Thanks again, Daniel, for filming when I was away. For the next Shalem video podcast, I'd love to hear from you. If you have any questions about Shalem that you'd like answered on the next show, or any suggestions about what you'd like to see on the show, please just email me. If I read your question or use your suggestion on a future episode, you'll win a Shalem t-shirt. As always, don't forget to check out our web presence by pointing your browser to ishalem.net, your portal to all things Shalem on the internet, including the Shalem blog and photo gallery. Thanks for tuning in. Until next time, from Yerushalayim, Kol Tuv.